Hi y'all, two packages came in the mail. Uh, I'm gonna just get right to it. Thought I kept this close by. This, I don't know if I ever told you stories about a guy who lived down the street from me. His name was John Pritchard. Uh, he passed away, he was 90 some years old. But the man, uh, sold a lot of he used to be a, a fixture at our card shows and he lived down right down the street from me he went to the same church as my uncle Nefty and it was I got to know him pretty good in fact he helped me with a lot of my stuff he gave me deals I mean like he sold my dad. Let's be with it. Garbage Pail Kids. I have Series 4, Series 5, and Series 9. I got all three of those sets for what you would pay for one. Uh, he he knew I painted, and uh, he made this deal with me. I can have the rookie year with Bird and Magic with Dr. J in it and the variations if I painted him a portrait of himself. So I got the set for like, I think it was like 100 bucks. At the time, I was going for three-something. And I had this painting of him. I painted, I don't know how many times. I wasn't happy with the way the face was turning out. Well, my mom and my dad said, you had that thing you've been working on in a year. Take it to Mr. Mr. Pritchick and see what he did. He loved it. So, years ago, ever since my back blew out, he wanted to get out. He wanted to retire from doing the, 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 the stuff. But I could never get up his house. Uh... My dad went up there once, but my dad doesn't know as much about non-sports as I do. And I was spoke, but I'm like, because of my back, I couldn't handle the drive up there. And then I'll be looking around all his stuff, because he had tons of stuff. He had a garage full. Well, he passed away, and I had him on my, my seller's list on eBay. Uh, I'll, put his, I'll put his name down below on the comment, because his son took over. And... Uh, I, like I said, I bought a lot of stuff. I bought he's, I got the sugar-free gum set out of him. I got a lot of the, uh, I got a lot of non-sports stuff off of him. Like, like I got Jaws, Jaws three, Dukes of Hazard series two. My dad bought it and didn't realize there was no stickers in it. And I need wrappers too, so I have to get send his son a list of like all the stuff I need wrappers for and stuff. So, but uh, that's what I got. I got an X file set off of his son. So, because I already have a binder marked X files, so I might as well just put them with the binder. But it does, it, it bummed me out that he passed away, but of course, nobody lives forever, and that's the sad part about being human. Now, I got three more figures for the collection. I think I told you the other day that I ordered them. I have what is this Buffalo Bill. I think this is Buffalo Bill Cody from the Legend of the Lone Ranger. Tonto. And the Lone Ranger himself. Who was that masked man? I still got coming a couple more figures. Uh, I have a little bit of a comic book set. In fact, I ordered the last I needed for Curse of Spawn. And I'll have that set finished when that comes. I actually have to go through this box of comics, pull what was sold, and go out in the garage, grab another box. And I see the cat is... Uh, I hate these animals. Yeah, dealing with uh, a bunch of animals in the house is not good. I'm glad they don't go in my attic where my comic books are, but they come down here where, where, where my video games and stuff are. I don't particularly care for that. You can't tell my wife or kids. 
And it seems like the, the population keeps growing. And I want to get rid of what I have. I already told them, I said, once the, they pass away, we're not replacing them. Because she bitches about me and my comic book collection and buying stuff. But uh, we actually spend probably about just as much money or more on feeding them and take care of the cats. I figure I, I want to spend over $1,000 a year just, take for, just for taking care of cats. Nuts. Cuckoo. Crazy. Loco. Attached. I'm flabbergasted. But that does it for this edition of King Joe's. As always, thank you all for viewing and subscribing.